Dr. Ahmed El Mandari, Regional Director, World Health Organization Regional Office for the Eastern Mediterranean. Distinguished participants, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for giving me the opportunity to participate at this high level meeting, addressing a very important topic that touches our daily lives and is closely linked to other sustainable development goals that I continue to support as a passionate advocate. Being a mother from the region with a family of my own, I am totally familiar with the important role the family physicians are playing in improving community health. Their role goes beyond the clinic to being fully engaged community partners, to being part of the family. I seek my family doctor's advice and support, not only when someone is sick, I also reach out to them for advice to maintain health, prevent disease, or just for checking medical information or second medical opinion. This strong physician-patient relationship requires dedicated practitioners who are well-trained, not only in medicine, but exceed that to develop skills such as communication and coordination, essential to fulfill their role delivering sound primary health care, advice, and treatment, referring cases to other health professionals and medical specialists, in addition to proactively supporting their communities with preventive health care measures. It's impossible to mention family doctors without references to high-quality primary health care. Family medicine is part of this bigger health system that is necessary to achieve population health and well-being, better patient experience, and lowering per capita costs of quality health care. The benefits of primary health care do not just impact the individual patient. Primary care also translates into healthier communities, as proven by research. An increase of one family physician per 10,000 people is associated with an average mortality reduction of 5.3% or 49 fewer deaths per 100,000 people per year. Our region has shortage and uneven distribution of family physicians, which negatively impacts population's health. Today, a call for action document is being declared to increase the number of qualified family physicians in the region through a regional professional diploma program. I stand before you today to support this cause fully. I believe that this family medicine program is an important regional initiative to help ensure high quality, efficient medical care by bridging the gap of family physician so shortage and attracting physicians to serve in communities that need them. This program will also help improve the way care is delivered and help meet our regional health care goals, paving the way for universal health coverage through World Health Organization's regional vision of health for all, by all. Thank you again for the opportunity to join you all today. Hence, Aubrey.